uh, how were your college days and how did you prepare for your uh, placement preparation yeah my college days were fun so uh, like every student we bunged a lot and you know went on road trips and uh, after some trips also but because of the pandemic it was cut short very soon uh, so and coming to preparations uh, you know every student will be like uh, we will start from 6 am we'll fresh from 7 am but actual preparation will be starting from 7 am itself yeah. when the actual heat of the you know placement will be starting yeah. so even my preparation was started from 7 am itself actually good so say uh, just say to our audience about your company dxc technology okay so dsc technologies is an mnc company based in us uh, it uh, gives services for ipo bpo and uh, clouds security mm-hmm. and also for company uh, you know easy working mm-hmm. so great it's really good so my fourth question is uh, fourth question is how is the recruitment process of your company okay so uh, dxc company recruitment process is uh, comparatively very easy from other companies okay mm-hmm. so other companies you know they involve uh, uh, five to six steps like first will be aptitude test then group discussion uh, and hr in technical and all so dxc is very simple first will be aptitude test okay, okay. so there will be seven rounds mm-hmm. uh, seven sections in it aptitude test mm-hmm. so first is aptitude logical english programming based mcq questions mm-hmm. and uh, essay writing and automata fix and uh, the main percentage will be on automata fix itself so automata in the sense like uh, they will be uh, giving a incomplete program and you have to analyze it yeah. and... so there will be errors in a program or a function will be incomplete we will have to debug the errors Achha. or else we will have to uh, you know complete the function to complete the program okay so what about the second stage i mean technical right yeah so after that it will be interview so uh, it will be technical and hr will be happening it one go itself okay so in the interview you know uh, whenever someone is going to an interview uh, not just in dx in uh, in general so mostly the questions will be based on how your interaction will be so for example if i go to a, a interview and if i say that i am a cloud developer or uh, you know machine learning engineer mm-hmm. something like that so all the next questions will be based on those uh, areas which you uh, say in the introduction itself acha so like uh, so yeah like everything depends upon the introduction right yes so if i uh, you know say that i am a, a network security engineer mm-hmm. so all the questions which will be coming up will be on network security engineer all. and the next step is uh, our resume should be you know in such a way that every part of the resume should be we should know it mm-hmm. okay there should be no part that uh, you know just for impression we will keep it there so if you do that you know in the interview it will go uh, it will be embarrassing if they ask questions or not and you will not be able to answer it so all the things in the uh, resume you should know it perfectly and only put those things in your resume which completely know about so like uh, make sure that what is there in the resume and you should have complete knowledge about it yeah only put those things which you really know don't put things for uh, impression based got it got it so here is the last question so any suggestions to our audience today? yeah um you know uh, like many of the students even i started my preparation uh, when the heat began uh, like yeah. in the seven sem heat yeah so if for the juniors if i had to suggest then from fourth sem or fifth sem itself go to hacker rank platforms india bix platforms where you will be getting you know uh, many coding questions and uh, aptitude questions where you can mm-hmm. go there and solve so even in hacker rank what happens is when you go and uh, get five stars in c++ or uh, problem solving or something mm-hmm. companies will be directly coming there and recruiting based on your uh, ranking there right so you know it will be uh, better for uh, on campus also and off campus also great great i mean like what the information you have provided to us is really what we say really plus point to us like people who are preparing in these days they will yeah. be these points gonna impact on those people and uh, they will be making good use of these points and uh, these tips actually yes. and uh, but the heat part yeah it really it's a, it's like a universal truth you know like yeah <laughs> you know how much ever we plan to do uh, we fail to do it but uh, at least whenever possible we have to uh, spend at least 30 minutes of our time whenever mm-hmm. possible on those platforms so when we come to that 7th sem 
we will not have so much of pressure on us it will be very easy going uh, thank you sir thank you for your inputs and uh, thank you for making time and uh, being here yeah thanks for uh, you akshay for you know giving opportunity to share my experience my pleasure